Mass targets with distance variation, uh, it's like the general mass target exercise, but instead of just stop starting at a lunge distance, at, or stopping at a lunge distance for a final distance, we're actually going to do variations based off of how far I start. So right now I can reach it in one simple footwork, lunge. And so for distance variations, we want to do attack, lunge, recover, take a retreat. Now for each of the attacks, we're going to advance lunge. Uh, special focus on making sure that the hand is moving progressively forward during the advance lunge. And that the heel still hits the ground, right? From here though, uh, instead of holding the lunge, I'd actually like the, the students to recover almost immediately. Right? So, and if you're advanced, then you can go ahead and then give a second tap on the way back out. Um, from double advanced lunge distance, still progressive hand moving forward. And then immediate recovery, back leg bent, then get out of town. Um, so for the more advanced fencers, instead of setting a fixed double advanced lunge distance, we're actually going to have them start from way out of distance. They have to advance up to the target, and then choose the distance at which they're going to attack. And that's mass targets with distance variation.